Hello guys, welcome. You're watching Technology Welfare. Let's see in this video tutorial how to connect a tiny umbrella with iPhone 7. Yeah. I will show you some strategy that if you implement, if you execute, you will be able to connect a tiny umbrella with iPhone 7. Because I have received number of the comment that's a how to connect a tiny umbrella with iPhone 7. So let's see here. First of all guys, you will have to install three or two simultaneously. Also tiny umbrella with Java also. It will be a functional in all operating system whatever that is a Windows 7, Windows 10, Windows 8, 8.1. One thing is very important that 64 yeah 32 bit of any operating system similar version of 32 bit yeah if you are using 64 bit then you will have to download 64 bit of tiny umbrella and immediately you have to install also Java there because as we know that while you will remove any iCloud from any iPhone device Whatever that cloud has been trapped in a lost mode, yeah, blank mode, yeah. Uh, if uh, uh, Apple logo is uh, coming on your iPhone device, yeah, if it's in activation mode, then there will be a vital role of a tiny umbrella to extract the whole, all data, and that's you would like to wipe out. And then, with the help of the other software that I have already uploaded on uh, my channel, so let's see how you will connect a tiny umbrella. See guys, first of all you will have to open, go for an administrator of uh, 3 or 2. So let's see. See guys, at the moment this phone has been connected. This is iPhone 7, 168 GB. So this is my iOS 13.2. So see here. ECID is a very important and also UDID this it's already verified so you have to go for verified it when you connect it will automatically configured and verify the everything that what you and what kind of the device of your Apple that you are using simultaneously if the three or tools is not going to functional then go for I2 iTools for you can install and you can get the all kind of the information that is available on desktop at the moment here. So first of all I will go for copy of this UDID. Just I copy it and I will minimize it. I will come now tiny umbrella. See guys 3U12 will be a functional while you install iTunes so it's very important to notify you guys that you have to install also iTunes in your PC or laptop while you're connecting Tiny Umbrella. Now see, this is a Tiny Umbrella guys. Here I'm going to connect to fetch OTI, OTA for all. So here, how I will connect? Just a simply I will come on Actions and here I will go for create device so directly if you would like to get these options by a key button then definitely you have to just a control press and you will be able to so let's see let's see it will come now see guys just here I have to paste UDID. This is a very important guys. UDID and plus ECID. Name and device manually you can also enter no problem at all. So see here once again I will come on a 3 tools and I will copy of ECID and I will come once again paste here. Now, device name and here, just I will check it out. 
see guys see firstly I will come here and I will see product type iPhone 9 so simply I will copy from here and I will come on device and I will enter this ones because see here according to your you can iPhone 7 7.2 6 so here just uh, iPhone type is here once again let me have iPhone 9 this is type product type is uh, iPhone 9 so just I will come here and let's see this is iPhone 8 iPhone 8.4 so most accelerated version you can enter here no problem at all so just I will 8.4 iPhone SE otherwise keep it here and just to simply I will go for here and firstly I will enter this iPhone name and once again most accelerated number most accelerated so here once again I will come scroll down it and just I will select here 8.2 8.4 so iPhone 8.4 approximately and I will go to create it so it's a saying that unvalid so I will go for here I will write here 7 now done see guys at the moment this iPhone 7 has been connected now so similar procedure you have to implement you have to proceed for connection from your iPhone to a PC especially for tiny umbrella now see guys when I will click here on fetch so it will start to fetch now see guys it's preparing so guys now this is a this is way that how you will connect a tiny umbrella if you are still face any inquiry yeah, if you if you are still facing any kind of the problem of course you have to raise the query guys below the comment box so this is all about in the uh, in this video tutorial guys thank you very much